Hello everyone, because second take of doing this because OBS is freezing up something terrible and I've got no, no idea why, probably needs to reset it but this is going to be a review of the airline Easy Get Trick um, putting it the, um, the quickest way was very much like Ryanair budget airline, um, quick and simple um, but um, for a more of a explanation, um, when when you go through, the seats are lined up, f f rows of three each side, with the aisle in the middle, obviously. Um, I believe two toilets. Um, to be fair, and ne never used any um, when when I was there. Uh, you do have um, something that that I did like. You had a little pocket in in front of you. Which has the um, the safety instruction card, which it wasn't printed on the um, on the sticker in in the, on the seat in front of you, like Ryanair, which is a bonus. Um, and it also had an in-flight magazine if if it was in there. Um, I think there's like one one per row, um, the in-flight magazine, and obviously in there you'll find the um, like perfume and other things and bits and pieces what you can what you can buy on on, on in in the air on on the plane um and good thing is um i don't think it gives you a qr code i think you can just look through the magazine pick what you want and basically tell them when, when they bring the cart down which was which was really good um did have a lap, lap tray which is good and um, no in-flight en entertainment which um pretty standard really for easy get because it's a bucket airline and it's mostly for short flights anyway so it wouldn't be it's like no 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 need to watch like a three hour film <laughs> when you're doing it um i believe um virgin atlantic and british airways are the only ones that have um in-flight entertainment such as like films and things like that um the seats were actually com comfortable um, it was like plush seating, like full fab fabricated seat seating, um, nice and comfortable, decent seat belts. Uh, you also like, obviously, it wasn't like Ryanair, which had like the um, cheap leather um, tacky seats, which yeah, and I'm, I'm not quite keen on them ones because they make you sweat more. Um, easier to clean now, I suppose. The um, I got a Snapchat. The um the actual flight was quite nice, um decent flight experience. Uh, this was from Luton Airport to Edinburgh Airport back in September. Um, a little bit of turbulence hit on the way back, but that was when it was a bit windy and we had rain in in the mainland England, so it was a bit bit rough coming back, especially when to land. But other than that, it's like smooth smooth landing anyway. Um, <laughs> to be fair. Think, um, yeah, I think, think that's it basically. I mean, it's not, not, not much more to say. Um, it was a Boeing plane, um, I can't remember what, what number it is. I, I don't normally like bother with that stuff as long as it gets me from A to B, it's pretty, pretty fine. I'm not like up there with aviation, um, but yeah, it, it was decent. Um, I can't. I can't remember how much it actually cost. I think it was like nearly two hundred pounds for two people return. Um, so um, yeah, decent. I suppose it's like not not bad. I know next year I plan to get two weeks off early March or last week off last week in February and first week in March. So I get two weeks off because I want to go to America. Um, then. And I want to go earlier in the year because, obviously, if you go in like September, October time, it's too it's too close to Christmas to go out somewhere like big like that. So I, I if if I choose somewhere big to go, um, like abroad and that, I normally use it at the beginning of of the year rather than at the end of the year because that way you can pay back slowly um as as the year goes on, so you don't have to like be be tight or be broke by christmas so yes yeah, it's, it's better to have a big holiday at the beginning of the year rather than the end <clears throat> then you can have like a small cheap holiday like like my um edinburgh um trip which was about roughly 750 quid all in i suppose without the um without dinners and 
entertainment there. So yeah, it, 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 it was pretty good. But yeah, that was the review of um, e the Easy Get Airline. Um, tomorrow I'll be having a lolcal video, and um, I'm it's gonna get a bit finicky, like from Sunday onwards, because I do have a bit of a backlog of um, videos to do that I want to do. So it's, it's still a lot of catching up um, at the minute. So hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys next time.